Everyone knows how important the internet's becoming for emerging artists, and no one knows that better than Alex Foster of your favorite enemies. Hey, welcome to Watch Mojo. I'm your host, Sasha, and we got to talk to Alex today about the worldwide fan base that they've got going and more about the tour as well. So far, are you guys having a good time on the tour? Yeah, it's been great. It's like a big circus, basically, here. The Vans Warped Tour is crazy, all the cool bands, and you know, but I think what I really like about the tour is the whole attitude. You know, the atmosphere and everybody's cool with everybody and, you know, there's no, like, rock and roll bullshit or whatever. So that's, so that's cool, you know. How long has your favorite enemies been, been around for so far? Uh, I think we had, like, different incarnations. Uh, we've been playing in different bands for quite a long time, all mixed up. And uh, your favorite enemies, like, uh, this lineup has been together for two years and a half. Now we, we have to finish the, uh, the album. We started the album producing the, uh, the full end album with uh, producer Steve Thompson. He worked with uh, Metallica and a few other small bands like that. So <laughs> we're, band. we're probably the you know. smallest band <laughs> he worked with. And um, I'm just kidding. And um, so we're going to finish the album. And then after that, we're going back to Europe. And then we uh, were supposed to tour in uh, Asia as well. And for last year, we started quite naively on, um, on MySpace. We got organized, but even before starting everything, for us, we said, well, what we really want to do is every single person who's going to write us a message, so we're going to take time to answer them. So, and a year later, I mean, it, that's, that's full-time commitment, believe me. And that's how we have, like, so many communities all around the world. We have, like, Japanese communities. Now they're, they're translating everything in their own language, in, in German and French. So there's a lot of things going on. So it's all about keeping yourself busy, I guess. So musically, who would you say that your band looks up to? Oh, man, that's a good, that's a good question. I mean, probably a little bit of Celine Dion mixed <laughs> with... Um, I don't know, Maria Carey, and uh, old school Whitney Houston, probably. Yeah, for sure. Yeah.